Hello guys, welcome to another video. My name is Dylan from Deals Fix. Today we're going to be fixing our iPhone 6 screen today. Hello guys, I'm back. The things we need to fix it, iPhone 6, the phone itself, you need a screen. Let me screen, you can see. Brand new screen, I'll leave it down below. You need some um, peaks to open the phone. You need, you need one of these, this shape. This screwdriver is the same shape as that, so you need one of these shape. Suction cups, you can get one and then pull it up like this. Suction cup, this one, there's some one in the back, and then it goes in the front and you can open it up, like so. Bottom screws, so now let's open the bottom with the bottom screws. There we go, that's one, that's two. Put that on one side after and then use the section cup on top of near the home button yep place it near the home button make sure the phone is off before you start repair is off for me so make sure any repair you do make sure the phone is off if you can't turn it off make sure you always unplug the battery so you don't damage the phone section cup two sides open it up like so like this like so you see, take the socks and cups off, then you get the broken screen, and then you peep. Um, you can use a box or you can use a stand, 90 degree stand, just stand it up, and then you get a screwdriver. Let me bring it back to bring it. If you take out these screws there, so you can unplug the battery. There we go, that's one. Put it where you know, that's one, that's two. And then you grab the plate, put it on the side, and then you unplug this port there. Be careful <laughs> before be careful. And then you fold it up so you don't it doesn't unplug it in by mistake. If you can see the screws, let me turn the screen around. These screws um take apart, unscrew them. But always put these ones in the right places. So you got map, just paste them one there, one there, one in the middle, one there, and one there. So you don't get mixed. Let's start with the middle one. Yep. In the middle. Then you start, start with any screws you want. But always put them in the right places. So you don't get mixed up. So get a magnet like this. Or you can get a big one like a whiteboard. Replace it, name it. It doesn't really matter what you do. There you go. Screw, unscrew this one as well. Put it in this corner. So each corner you take off. That's the middle. That's one side. There's another side. So four screws, basically. The long one, always go in that corner, always. So always leave it in that corner. Don't mix your screws up. Lift it up slowly if you want to move it on one side or something like that. If you want to get like it's nice tools, get it from my fix it. Leave it there, then move it on one side again so you can have space to unplug. It's about four bits. Be careful so you don't damage it. That's what I'm trying to be careful. Like that, that's four. Three. One more. Unplugged, and you just take off your stand. If you're standing on one side, move the phone on one side for now so you can move the old stuff to the new screen. Move that one side as well. So four clips be careful so you don't damage it that's what i'm trying to be careful like that that's four three one more move the phone on one side for now so you can move the old stuff to the new screen the new screen no the old screen and the new screen so now let's turn it round so the old screen got damaged the new screen got bubble wrap all the permanents are the same you can get screens that doesn't have the camera you can replace the camera yourself the, but the home button you always have to replace because if you don't replace you won't get fingerprint but you can put a new home button in but you won't get fingerprint back so you can use it without a fingerprint so yep now let's unscrew this home button and bring it to the 
new screen so you unscrew your screw put it in the right places like always so one two take the plate off put it so you don't now you unplug this one carefully there we go carefully and then it's unplugged now so now you take the home button inside put it in inwards like so carefully rip it because it's like got little glue yes so don't pull it so i'll pull it gently so you don't like damage the home button so there's the home button off the screen now you can put that one side now so you don't need the speaker because you've got it on there now just peel this off so you always make sure the button goes on straight like so make sure to click it, click it in slowly if it doesn't click in the first time don't damage it you pull the seal off what's it not um, there you go plugged in i think yes yeah, plugged in now now you put the plate in this way always put one screw in first so you can like see where the second one goes like so next one like so let's see if it clicks it clicks all right it's a missing screw up there and up here you've got a screw there so all you do is just nick it off that screen you can see nick that screw that i'm putting in now there you go oh, okay it's not straight in it's not straight in just unscrew it there you go it's straight in now take this screen put on one side now we don't need anything from that old screen new screen now you put the screen back in the new screen back in to the phone so that so that's bend it in corn just bend it so you can plug it in slowly now it clicks in the first one clicked in perfect the second one clicked in the third one clicked in right this one be careful of because you can break it one more clip has to be plugged in and then we can test it put the plate in test it yeah there we go and then you put it back onto here paper clip um into your box plastic rubber band or if you've got a 90 degree sort of thing like a stand you can get it then use that because you want to find that one easier than dust in my way so that box keep moving you can see it so you plug it in all be careful don't twist the cable that's why I always be careful always be careful all the screws are plugged in and screwed in there neatly it's only like two more long one the long one always in that going back in that corner like so I fix it uh, Amazon you can get the screws screwdrivers except companies put down below what company to go to to get your screens and then you plug it in before you put the plate in for the battery test it because that's in case you damage the screen or anything if it turns on if it has battery let's check and then we can put it back on the box 90 degrees so i can do that plate near the battery how you can check because i can't get into the phone how you can check if you can do them stuff that means the phone is working perfectly now you just turn off the phone turn off the phone and screw that plate in because it happened to be me before when you twist the screen um connectors or something by mistake and you see yep you can see let me move it a little bit more so you can see um better but you can see still good so one screw in the long screw always goes in there and then the small screw goes there put it from the top first and then the bottom is it clicked in already wow it is clicked in 
Now you put the, let it turn on, put the bomb screws on, uh, put the bomb screws on, like so. So turn it off the fan so it doesn't ding because it's a customs fan. Is it clipped in now? Yep, hopefully. Now you put the other screw in, there we go. Like so, put your tools on the side because you won't, you won't need to use it. Screen done, perfect. Put the box on the side. New screen, well, let's turn it back on again and see if it works. Turning on, you can see it's turning on. Make sure it turns on. Make sure I didn't damage it when I screw in the bottom. There we go, all working. Uh, let's turn it off. So the phone is now fixed. If you like this video, subscribe and like. See more of deals fix, how you fix phones, unboxings, stuff like that. If you like, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. If you want to see more of me fixing a phone, subscribe. And I'll leave descriptions down below where you can get the tools from. Leave the link to my website, my Instagram, my Facebook page. And see you for the next video, guys. See ya.